do your friends call you be like, you're on the radio, bitch, you gonna be like, I'm trying to like that. Yes, all the time, especially my auntie. Anytime she meets a fan, she like, this my niece right yeah. here. I'm like, oh my God, here she go again. I live. From Amazon Music, it's The Walkin', honey. Back, back, back again with another fabulous episode of The Walkin'. I'm your host, Mo Hart, and I'm on my way to meet the talented and always fashionable Flo Millie. Alabama-born Flo Millie is a rap superstar. At just 23, Flo Millie's undeniable talent and show-stopping looks have her conquering the worlds of music and fashion. You still here, ho? <laughs> First of all, I love the fit. Thank you. You look amazing. Come into my house. I'm excited to get into your closet. Yes. yes. Come see my closet. Let me get in. I let me get wait. in. Ooh. Oh my gosh, this yes. is gorgeous. Thank you. The beating. You know I gotta put you yes, on. I live. We call this segment of the show the Fashion Rewind, where we get to find out the in-depth who you are, how you got started, and now I want to jump into this green girl. Oh, this is giving me very it. money. Yes, it's giving money for a reason. This was my collab with Rico Nasty, and I loved every bit of it. And we had to show out, you know. First of all, this was originally jean, and then we colored it green for the money aspect. Everything was based off of the, the Wizard, Wizard of Oz. Yes. So it was definitely giving bad bitch Dorothy. I'm living that this is denim and you dyed it. Now yes. I'm even more intrigued. <laughs> yes, oh we have my to dye gosh. it. <laughs> did you wear these beautiful shoes? Yes, you know I did. These, oh my God. And we put the rhinestones on my lips, oh so we had to match the. I remember filming with Rico for yes. season one when y'all were actually oh doing wow, the song. So this crazy. is like a big, like full wow, circle moment. I didn't even know that. That's yes, crazy. This is so awesome. I live. Really though. Rico, that's my girl. She called me and told me we were shooting a video. I was like, oh, call up Jenna, cause I'm ready. <laughs> yes. I'm ready to pop our because I was really excited. <laughs> Tell me about this 1920 retro moment. This whole aesthetic came from when I started to shoot for Roaring Twenties. Okay. And this was also custom made as well. Do you sew your own? Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. I was I like, know. wait, <laughs> what? Now, I ain't gonna lie, I did take one little sewing class in high school. One, but okay. Yeah. That's so, can you sew a straight line? <sighs> Honestly, it's been you know, like girls five like us years. have curves, so it's fine. I know we we have to be good though. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I always have the problem where like my waist is too small and then everything else fits. Right. <laughs> Tell me more about the 1920s. You have like a flosephine yes, thing, right? Right. Flosephine. <laughs> My oh. fans were calling me that. It was so funny. Um, it was honestly so crazy how intentional that was. First of all, I shot that music video on my birthday. It was freezing cold Ooh. and it was a lot of commitment there. <laughs> but <laughs> it was a flip on if I was a rich man, I'd do all these things. Right. But I'm not a rich man, I'm a rich <laughs> Take a snap to the room, please snap to the room. Yes, 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 I live. <laughs> Tell me what was it like growing up in Mobile, Alabama and you knowing from the jump, I ain't gonna be here long. <laughs> Like, I, honey, it's stardom. Oh, I had a strong, strong desire to be an artist, mm -hmm. and I felt like if I did not pursue that, I could not live. Like, that's literally I how I feel. If you really want something, you're either gonna find a way or find an excuse. Right. And I always found a way. I was paying for, like, studio time and all of that starting out. I literally started writing music in my notebook. I found the best studio in my city, and they were like, almost $200, and back then, that was yep, a lot of money. A lot of money, baby, that's a lot of money right now. For a 17-year-old, 16-year-old, like, I didn't have the money for that. You know how they had, like, influencers? Back in the day, Instagram was really, really popular. Yeah. And I would ask them, what would they promo rate? I paid somebody, like, $100 to post, like, a 30-second video of me rapping. Yeah. And then I would go to the studio, the next week I got a check, and then I would actually record it once it was written, and then I would drop the song once I got all the attention. After you had built, built the hype, I Yeah, think. after yeah. I built the hype, and then I would do that for each song. Put in the hard work. And the people that you see winning, they are winning because they've been dedicated to their craft. Yes, you, it's always gonna pay off, I promise. Come on, praise, praise, yeah! So these two custom looks were latex looks that I wore in the PBC music video. Oh my god. Yeah, back to back hours of latex, honey, it was crazy. 
<laughs> it was crazy. I live. <laughs> they don't even tell you when you wear this type of sweat. You're sweaty. How long were you in it? Honestly, like hours. Yeah, and it was both of these, so. Wait, so you went from this one, uh, and then trying to put another one on? Uh, another one. Oh my Just god. Wait. And this was the same show? Yes. This was a tough cookie right here. I think so, with all these little, like, yes. straps probably grabbing and hugging on the body. Yes, and then on top of my head, it was just a lot. Word. Know? What shoes did you wear with this? Because I'm really intrigued. Platform heels, but they were Please like this. Come on, the good old drag yeah. shoe. Yeah, the good know. old silver heel. Yeah. <laughs> what size do you wear? <laughs> size nine. A size nine. Yeah. All the cute shoes stop at a size nine. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh, please tell me, very Marie Antoinette. Yes, I honestly, you just unlocked a memory with this one, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, come on, unlock, unlock, unlock. <laughs> this was for the Rich the Kid video. It was me, him, Lotto, Ruby Rose, it was called Nasty, and these were Christian Louboutin heels that went with that. Ooh. And they were custom on top of that. Tell me, what was your first big splurge? Ooh, child. My first big splurge was probably my Corvette. Oh. Like, I woke up randomly and was like, I want a Corvette today. I got the last one. Somebody was actually about to buy it because they were like back ordered, and I just got lucky that day. I was I like, <laughs> right now. These are my Flo Millie gloves. Oh, I love the BD. Karen made these. Shout out to Karen. You know, I feel real powerful when I have my Flo Millie gloves. I think we should bring them back. You know what I think you could do? What, what if you made them merch? I like how you did. I would love to be I at like the concert like did. this. Hey. Everybody put your hands in the air and they're like, yes! <laughs> and they would sparkle, girl. Yes. Oh. Yeah, it's giving Flamilla Terry. She'll years. have them in six months on her website, okay? <laughs> Boom. That's Stay fun. tuned. How does it feel being your name, Flo mm -hmm. Millie, is up there with the rap girlies? Like, and the good rap girlies, not just, you know, the girls that's out here, you know, you're you doing know. it. <laughs> I don't know, man. I just, I have a spark in me and. It's just like, I try not to get caught up in that. It, it is good to like acknowledge, yeah. like, you know, you are doing something. How does the family feel? They are honestly really proud of me. Cause like all my whole childhood, I walked around the kitchen like, I'm gonna be a celebrity, I'm gonna be famous. Yeah. Just speaking it and now it's like, wow, she really said it. She really <laughs> like, did it. Yeah. Let that be proof and evidence to everyone at home. You gotta it, speak it. You gotta speak it. Power in the tongue, like honestly. Tell me about this one because she don't need me. I'm crying. No, literally, I love her so much. Oh my God. This was actually from another look from the Roaring Twenties video. Mm. Yeah, this was my swing look. I was freezing outside. Oh my gosh. What was the hair for this? Definitely Flossophine Baker. Okay. Finger waved up. Uh huh. I have one beaded garment and you have three. I'm uh. like. What? What is going on? Given twinsies. Oh, this was for another performance that I did on Zoom. I Zoom live. looks were killing. Okay, huh? the Zooms look. The checks were coming through that. And that's <laughs> all that matters, they baby. They were <laughs> Trying to do drag and performances <laughs> on Zoom. They're like, oh, this looks crazy as hell. You're like, I feel stupid as <laughs> Tell me, this is gorgeous. I love the cutouts. Yeah. The way it just looks like it hugs the body. Yes, this is another custom look for Zoom. <laughs> Zoom, baby, we was zoomed out. We were giving Zoom It's another for Zoom. <laughs> Yes. This is was... giving me very, not black swan, but like pink swan. I feel yeah. like you sure be a ballerina in this moment yes, as well. Just... Major like bad Tinkerbell. Yes! Like... Now we are gonna push on to the future. We call this the fashion <laughs> forward. So tell, ooh, come on, Swaggy yes. Booty King. Yes, you know I have to have a custom look every time. Yeah. So you know purple is my color. This is the Mugler look from Rolling Loud from last year. Real honey, not the fake. <laughs> I've never held anything to say, Blair. <laughs> this is amazing. This is when around the time I dropped my You Still Hear whole album. Tell me about these names real quick. <laughs> Can we just talk about the names? Like, so you know, I'm a I'm a real reality TV fanatic, and I got that line from Jocelyn when she said, yeah, oh, "I didn't hear it," and it was so random. I was like. That's my album name. So I was like, we gotta have something that grabs the attention. Yes, it really does. Yeah. <laughs> it really, really does. And you're like, oh, she means business. <laughs> it's 
So this was Hudson. This was the second night of my tour. You um, know what, you said, look, I'm gonna be comfortable. <laughs> yes. Okay, I know that's I right. That. So purple is a favorite color of yours. Yes, I'm really into like aura colors and I feel mm. like colors, names, numbers, all that holds meaning. Mm. And I know that purple is, is ruled by royalty. Mm -hmm. And so I feel like I'm very royal. Okay, do you have a favorite number? Yes, what is this? seven, Four. as you can see. Okay. I got that tag on me. <laughs> Tell me why is that significant or anything? I just know that's God's number. Amen, know? that's what I was hoping she was going yes. Good night, church, amen. <laughs> Good night. Now tell me about this. We recently wore this to Coachella. I did. I wore this outfit the first weekend to Coachella. I did a collab with Pucci, and they made some custom looks for me, so. They collab with my, my stylist, Jenna Tyson. And it's so crazy, this wasn't on there originally. Jenna added these, which made it like 10 times even more cuter, so. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, because <laughs> first when you said it was Pooch, I said, oh, yes. I can go order up there. Yes. Oh, so your stylist, <laughs> our stylist. Yes. This is what I'm talking about. No shade to the people at home. This is drag, okay? <laughs> you are is. born naked and the rest is drag. Yes, okay, it really, really is. It you gives... need to sparkle for the stage. We are in sunlight right now. You see the way Seriously. it is? Do you see the in sun? sunlight, baby? Coachella's hot, too. Yeah. I needed something that I could really like move around in. What was the shoe? It was a blue patent leather Pucci sneaker, and it was so comfortable. Okay, perfect. Like, I was oh like, are she, is she like killing her feet in high heels? <laughs> like, I uh, just loved it. Amazing. Tell me about Coachella, like first time performing, correct? Right? Yes, that was my first time. Okay. First of all, it didn't hit me until like a week before, and I'm like in my car just driving, like, what the. F I'm performing at Coachella in one week. This is just like one of the things I've always like prayed for. Yay. So I don't know. It was very like exciting to just see my fans. And Do your friends call you? Be like, girl, you're the ready on this. You're gonna be at Coachella yes. like that. <laughs> yes, all the time. Oh, yeah. Especially my auntie. Anytime she finds, she meets a fan. She like. This my niece right yeah. here. I'm like, oh my God, here she goes. I live. Oh my gosh, I truly, truly love you. Like, I'm like, this is my little sister. But before we go, I want to play a little game with you. Let's play. Okay, now these questions are based off of your music, so here you go. What type of person are you at the party? I'm definitely late to the party. <laughs> Same. And then I'm the center of the party. Okay, right, okay. Because you know, bad bitch show up late, you know? Well, I wanted y'all to be here so y'all could accept me. Yes. Be, okay, give me my intro on <laughs> that part. What's your bedtime these days, and is it ever the same two nights in a row? I'm in the studio 24-7, probably like 6 a.m. But if not, maybe like 12 to 10, yeah. I live, well, we see the work, pay off, okay. <laughs> What's something that you're trying to master? Definitely my workout routine. Okay. Because I need a fat ass by summer. I live! What's your biggest pet peeve? My biggest pet peeve is when somebody tells me what's gonna happen in a movie before it happens. Mm. For your shows, will you like not get on the internet because you don't want? Yes, I'm that person because I'll, I'll be on Twitter and then something will show and I'm like. Ruined it, ruined it. When are you most feeling yourself? Wearing probably my robe or my lingerie with my wine and my candles. I yeah. live. I love it. <laughs> this has been amazing. Yes. Thank you so much for coming in. Look, we got to walk in and get to hear your stories. Now we're about to walk out. We love you. Is there anything you want to say to your fans? I want to say I love you guys as well. Thank y'all for supporting me. And stream the music, ho. Amazon Music. Ow. <laughs> Thank you so much. We have walked in. We're walking out. We'll catch you next time. We love you all. Bye. Come on, sis. Thank you so much for watching. Click here to subscribe and click here to watch more episodes of Walking. And click here to listen to me on Amazon Music. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.